All right, YouTube, let's talk about honesty. Let me tell you, I just got off and I vlogged that I had a fish and a small fry from Arby's for five bucks. That's my only meal. So, with the eight dollars, I got a fish and a small fry for five dollars and thirty nine cents. So that left two dollars and sixty. I'm sorry, and seventy one cents, or sixty one cents. I'm sorry. And I took one of the dollars because I was still hungry. And they have this new promotion, donate a dollar, get a free small fry and a cup of cheese when you donate. So I donated a dollar to get me another small fry because I was hungry. So that is what I do to bootstrap. Now, I want to go back a little bit, back to the holidays. You know how sometimes you sit there, you be patient, you're a good team player, you're this, that, and the other, and you are. You know? Okay, here I come for the cookie. And you wait, you know, you don't, you're, you're the anticipation of people wanting to reward you for their wrongdoing to you. You wait. So I overheard a conversation at Union Depot. Caucasian woman, blonde hair, glasses. She was with her daughter and her husband. They happened to be taking pictures in front of the Christmas tree. As I was sitting there, I was putting on my concealer or whatever, and I heard her say, we fooled her. We put the Christmas money on the pregnant girl and, and gave her the F you finger. I heard her. It's evident because I'm still outside and I don't have any money. And, they, and the Senate hasn't even looked into the fact that I need a house. So that's evident. So... Let me talk about the definition of a slither. You know, from the Webster, it's a snake. And snakes can't be trusted. They carry disease. They'll, their, their venom is supposed to be killers. Not all of them, just some. You know, snakes' heads split sometimes, and they shed their skin, which means they show their true color. At this point, I'm going to show my true colors. No matter how poor you say you make me, I'm going to talk about how stupid you are. Do you want to know why this country continues to have to steal? Because you are inferior. You want management in play that really doesn't have any education, that doesn't understand labor dollars, that doesn't know how to coincide or do anything with, with nothing. And ones that actually do, like me, you don't like me. I don't care. So, I make the comment all the time, you know, I'm walking around with my bum self, but I'm not really a bum. Anybody that takes away your positive goals just to make their self-esteem look better and to make you look stupid, they're inferior. I'm allergic to lace, so I'm itching. And why am I saying this? 
because there is no way no 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 woman no no man no anybody should be sitting inside of a restaurant all day long trying to find something to do deterred from going to the job centers and libraries because every time you go here come the police for some other fun some unknown reason you know every time you go to to somewhere they say you delivered something and you actually got homeless bags on your back like i said if we're looking for a theft my advice is that you go to the babies the pregnant girls that you gave that christmas money to you know, after you said you used me, I don't care who the feds are. What you going to do? Come arrest me. You should have, if, but you didn't because I didn't do anything. No, thank you. You know, since we thought she was crazy. But her feelings are just hurt because she didn't look for anything because she thought that your theft was actually helping and aiding the economy. But in all actuality, it was aiding your pocket with your non-financial responsibility behind. So as the, you know, let me, let me tell you what they pick. I got a free degree, but I don't know anything about being a doctor. I don't even know how to do a stitch properly. I got a free degree, but I really don't even know how to multiply, add, subtract, and divide, but I'm management. I got a free degree, you know, because they gave me a brand new car, you know, and I outside with them. You know, I talk a good game, but I, I really don't have the knowledge and understanding of exactly what's going on. And that goes for both sides. Goes for both the Republicans and the Democrats. And I've never been in between anything because I've stood on exactly what I, I, what my my morals, my honesty, my integrity value. But nobody saw that. So what they do is. You know, we'll give you the garbage on the forward. You know, this is what the Asians say. Did you not know the first case of COVID was here at the University of Minnesota? And it wasn't me, but I got the bill for it. Did y'all know that? And I had to write, uh, it was some collection agency in Alabama. I had to write a, a dispute letter to it. You know, this is an attempt to collect a debt. Anything obtained will be used for that purpose. And then they give you 30 days to dispute the, the validity of the debt I had to. First case of COVID, University of Minnesota. And that person's pregnant now. Not only COVID, she had something else too. Ask me how I know. I got the bills. When the University of Minnesota admitted this person, they admitted this person under my name, which was identity theft. Like I said, if I wanted to be a snake, I would have asked to be one. But see, I went to school for real. So now I'm actually being a snake by putting your business out there. They're too busy taking away my positive goals to give me a negative outlook on life instead of helping me do what I need to do. What do I have to lose? What you gonna do, come up there and shoot me? What the fuck do I have to lose? Nothing. You took everything, you know, like I'm God. What the fuck do I have to lose? I don't care anymore. I don't care anymore, you know. Here, give the, the bomb $8 in all actuality. You know, the snakes chose project. What do I have to lose? I don't have anything. You know, you pay my kids off. 
and they don't talk to me and I work my hands to the bones for many years to keep them ungrateful bastards out of the projects and off of welfare. So what they're looking for is for me to hold them up. I'm not. I'm homeless. I don't deliver and that's for the police. I don't have a vehicle. I don't rob banks. I don't steal from registers. I'm not a ghost employee. I'm not pregnant. All I asked for was a job so I can go on about my business. I'm tired of sleeping on people's floors. You gave the money to the pregnant women. So what the fuck do you need with my name? Let me go. You know, the same with the clear eye. You know, I put my glasses on. Can't nobody see nothing. And that's why I wear them. But yet and still, we got these women getting these 5000 6000 7000 cat dollar cash apps a week. But then they turn around and they hurt me to make me post to social media because who they gave the money to, the snakes, can't get the job done. So they hurt me. And they don't realize I'm hurt for real. And I wouldn't give a damn how many pistols you pulled. I'm not going to stop speaking out. Police, take those guns off of me. You shoot somebody that's on your own. I, I could have swore you put the conceal and carry sticker at 538 St. Peter. So why are you using my name? The same place where the American Freedom Card is going. But you used my name. And that's why you locked me up for a simple violation of trespass, which should have been a, a fingerprint and a release. But you kept me in there because you asked me on live for my fingerprints. Like I said. I don't want to marry nobody up here. I can't stand them. And that's real. I could have taken care of myself a long time ago. But because of my skin color and because the brothers up here, they, they cater to the white girls. And I'm not hating on that. But let me be who I am. So they go get their A from the white girls. I'm hoping she got that get out of jail free card for a brother. I'm hoping that they do, you know?